it doesn't look good. Unfortunately, we're going to see tomorrow. He was struggling in the last month about the problem in the knee. Um, Pep, I'm sorry to ask you not about football to start, but you spoke so passionately about the anti-racist message last week. There was this plane that's flown over the Etihad tonight. We've heard from the Burnley captain, the Burnley manager, condemning the people behind it. Um, what, what was your view of it? Uh, did you have a view on it? Have you spoken as a group about what was said? About what? Sorry, I... I... There was a banner flown over the stadium tonight. Um, a oh. small minority of Burnley fans have put a banner out saying, "All uh, sorry, white lives matter, Burnley. Um, obviously, the Burnley club, the manager, the captain have come out and condemned it. You spoke very passionately about an anti-racist message after the game last week, and I just wondered what your thoughts were on this. I prefer, uh, with the manager and captain said this statement, that is the most important thing. So, of course, the white lives matter but uh, the black lives matter too so so the human being matter so everyone so we are the same i i travel a lot around the world i live in many many countries and every one of us we are the same absolutely the same with the same fears the same joy the same good things bad things not for a color skin is going to be different one place or any other place. So white lives matter, of course, but the black too. And does this just further highlight why it is so important that everyone in football and everyone around the world continues to show this unity and this anti-racist message? It's never end. It's every day we have to fight for not just the situation for all the for all the injustice that we can get and as a human beings all around the world. So the Mediterranean Sea is dying people, people, people in the Euro European uh, Union. We cannot do anything to rescue them. So, so there are many. So it's every day. Start for the schools, for the new generations, understand that we are equal. We are the same. And uh, the education will save us. That's the only thing. Well said again. Thank you, Pep. Simon from BBC. Uh, Pep, hi. Um, do you despair that this message just doesn't get home and people don't want to listen to anti-racism messages? So we are going to change the situation. It, it takes for, for 400 years. So for, it comes from long, long, you know, for a long time ago. It's going to change for one week. So you need time. And then... The racism is still there, it's still here. And you have to, to fight every day in our behaviors and condemn the bad thing that I no, appreciate, he knows. I, I, I never doubt about this, the Sean, Sean Dyke and the captain making a statement on Barley. So like Jurgen said, don't give sometimes importance you know, for, for uh, for this, uh, maybe few people have organized this ban. Important is the, the fight every day, what you have to do. And can I just ask you about the football? Sergio Aguero went off after the penalty. Um, what is the issue and, and how serious is it? It doesn't look good. Unfortunately, we're going to see tomorrow. He was struggling in the last month about the problem in the knee. And now he felt something, so we'll see tomorrow exactly what he has. But uh, it doesn't look good for this season. Thank you. James Robson, please go. Hi, Pep. When, when you see a performance like that from, from Phil, does that, does that fill you with confidence that he can be someone who can fill the void left by David Silva when he goes uh, at the end of the season? Phil, Phil is Phil. David is uh, difficult to to find a replacement like him. What he has done. So this club, for the people from Abu Dhabi, want to cover that is an important thing with investments in a good player has done. But the players like Joe Hart, Pablo Zabaleta, Sergio, Yaya Ture, uh, many of these players and David as well. So help us to be who we are as a team, as a club. So. 
it's difficult to find a replacement, but of course we have a, a young Manchester City fan when uh, every time he plays has something unique, his passion. He gives us his passion to, the, to, to all of us in the way he trains and the love he plays football and every time he plays, plays good. So he's a guy who plays close the box, has a sense of goal, incredible. And uh, in the next decade, 15 years will be an outstanding player for us, for this amazing club. So I don't have doubt any uh, doubt because I saw him, his behavior when he doesn't play. Uh, and in the training sessions, I never complain, never bad face. And when your behavior is in that way, always you can improve. With the bad faces, you cannot improve. It's impossible. In a good face, as always, you can improve. You want to listen, want to learn, and he deserves to be part of this squad. And every minute he gets, he's well deserved. Simon from the MEM, please go. Um, did you say Sergio Aguero doesn't look good for the season? Yeah. Tomorrow we'll see. We'll we'll know exactly what 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 he has. But the doctor said it will be take time. So he'll definitely be out for the next few games, you think? In a few games, for sure. But maybe tomorrow the, the test he's going to get, and maybe it's a good news. We'll see. Sam at the Athletic, please, guys. Hi, Pep. Um, James was asking there about Foden and, and David Silva. I know you mentioned him as an option on the left wing the other day. What kind of qualities does he give you on, on that side? And... Do you prefer him on the left or in the middle? It's the good players play in everywhere. So the guys who understand the game, what he has to do in every single moment in the game, in every single action, he can play everywhere. And Phil is one of them, especially up front. So, of course, he's not a winger, winger, but he can play. We cannot forget he won the World Cup with England, playing the right winger. So he can play in this position, can play in everywhere in position, but I like him playing close to the box, because it has something special, the sense of goal. It's not easy to find wingers, the sense of goal. So we scored last day, he scored today too, and uh, make an incredible assist. The penalty, he make a pass to Sergio too. So he's a guy, he always, when he's close to the box, always uh, gives something. And, and, and yeah, we, we can count on him, we, without a doubt. You said he's not a winger winger, like a proper winger like Leroy maybe, but does that matter then? Or does he have other skills that mean that he can still play there a lot? He like, can play there. Of course, not a winger, winger all the time, but he can play there. So I think he can play in all positions up front, all of them, all positions. Guys, if you want to ask a question, now's the time to click the icon. Yeah, sorry. Um, just because I saw Phil walking around, well, I think he had ice on his knee. Is that a bad? Is that a bad one, or is, is he okay? Phil? Yeah, I think no, he had kick in the kick in the muscle. No, nothing, nothing, nothing bad. Nothing wrong. 